Give me a little bit of insight. I think that Busquets, in terms of uh, um, the, uh, how clever, how he understands the game, he's not the fastest. In fact, he I think he's slow. He was slow at that time, but how he managed the game, how he controlled the game, he was the best by far. Mm. And and you can see that maybe he doesn't have the, the, the spotlight that other players have, but in terms of how he controls the game. In that position, that time Xavi Alonso was very good, but Busquets for me was number one by mm. far. The thing is that we were in a team that there was so much talent with Messi, you have Eto'o, but then Henri, uh, you had, uh, then Ibrahimovic came, Villa, yeah. uh, Pedro, uh, Pedro. You, you had so many uh, and good talent that it was very difficult to shine because other players were getting mm. all the recognition. But, uh, I mean, I think that the whole team uh, was amazing. The, the final in Champions League, in, I think it was against you in London, that game that game was... I think that was the best game we played. Uh, that was one game in my whole life that I finished and I was on the pitch and I said to Skulls and I think Giggs, that was so embarrassing <laughs> that you was that good. And it almost took away the feeling of how bad it was because actually I thought it was the best club team I ever played against. And yeah. I think it's the best club team we've ever seen. 